SWOT analysis is a key part of any business and strategic plan. SWOT stands for strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. While strengths and weaknesses are internal origin attributes of the organization, opportunities and threats are external origin attributes of the environment. While strengths and opportunities are helpful to achieve the objectives, weaknesses and threats are harmful to achieve the objectives. A SWOT diagram analyses a project or a business venture by focusing on each of these factors. Typically consists of four boxes one for each area. First, you want to figure out how to build on the strengths of your organization. A SWOT analysis will help you to identify the parts of your business that are doing well. In order to identify your strengths, you need to ask what the organization does exceptionally well. What are the advantages of the organization? What are the resources of the organization? What customers identify as strengths of the business? These are critical success factors, aspects of your business that are strong and give you a competitive advantage. Recognizing these assets will help you to continue on at a high level and you will need to find ways to leverage and build upon this strength to grow your business. Next, you will want to identify ways to improve your weaknesses. Weaknesses are the factors that put you at a disadvantage to your competitors. Figuring out what these weaknesses are and taking actions to lessen them before they hurt your business is essential. This stage requires a detailed and candid analysis of what is going wrong within your organization. Now, you will try to identify the opportunities available for your business. Try to pinpoint openings in the marketplace that you can take advantage of to help your business grow. These opportunities are caused by external factors such as market fluctuation and trend. Not every opportunity is right for your company at the moment, but it may be not too far down the line. And now, we will try to figure out how to respond to threats to your business. Market fluctuations, government regulations or public perceptions are all external factors that may affect your business in a negative way. By identifying these threats and finding ways to lessen or eliminate them you are clearing the way for smoother sailing as with opportunities, you need to consider strengths and weaknesses when assessing threats. Here are some tips to keep in mind while doing the SWOT analysis. Try to keep your SWOT diagram brief and to the point. Get feedback from employees, partners, and customers from varied perspectives. Arrange the result of your analysis in order of the most important factors to the least and don't forget to subscribe.